Bosa with a Bosa bomb. Car goes down courtesy of Joey Bosa. Goodness gracious, he's unstoppable. Here comes the run. They've got him again. Wrapped up, and he's dropped. How good is Joey Bosa? Are you kidding me? He takes the snap, and he is hit and brought down. Under pressure, drop Joey Bosa. Cannot block these guys. Joey Bosa here with the Los Angeles Chargers with my buddy Alama. My name is Alama Collins. Like you said, um, I'm from Long Beach Wilson High School, and I play a uh, de defensive tackle. All right, let's get in these plays. Oh my God, right through there. <laughs> Gotta hit that swim move. I shortened up my stance so I could read the offensive lineman faster. Oh, so you uh, you leveled out your feet a little bit more? Yep, basically. Rather up. than getting too vertical on your first step? Mm -hmm. Okay. And then one Yeah, I like to do it. that. I like to do that when I'm in a, in a six technique on the tight end. I usually play a, a even my feet up a little bit more, so I'm able to read, like you said, him pulling left or right, but that's a great job there. Uh, junior year, man, that was my favorite year in high school. That was when I was just a bully out there. <laughs> <laughs> kind of a big moment here. For me, a spin move comes maybe once, twice a game. I'm more of a speed power guy, um, so, so I'm setting up that speed all game, and as you can see here, I, I love I'd really like to sell it upfield, get that shoulder in there, almost selling a rip. And when you get him to lean right there, boom. That was that was a huge gap that you created with the tackle and guard by bringing him yeah, out there. Yeah, for sure. And you see that the my three technique, JJ did it. Well, he's in a two eye right there. He did a good job uh, selling that guard. That's working together right there. It's hard. Yeah. It's almost impossible to get sacks on your own. It's, it really takes a whole D line. Maybe I'll grab my glasses so I can not lean so far. In. All right, I have glasses now. I can see. Okay, so this one, I'm gonna get my sacks. Little, what, bull pull? So I, yeah, I had to like, um, so basically I just shot my uh, my arms out and then he thought I was gonna um, bull, bull rush him all the way to the quarterback. But then, yeah, um, yeah I, I, I pushed him back in and then I, I ripped and then yeah, I made the sack. That's a really nice move. Shoot. Yeah, because I, I set him up with that all game. Like, I kept on bull rushing in, in the, like, the first quarter, my first couple of series. Yeah, and you and brought that rip right there real high to clear it. Yeah, you're a smart player. I see you, you're making a lot of good calls off of there, like alignment and game plan and everything. It's really impressive. And then the finish. Yeah, <laughs> Not yeah. getting away I from me. Him down, yeah. The death group, yeah. Yeah, I called game here. Another, I'd like to say, uh, effort play here. Did you see him lean over? Right here, so yeah, I was going a little bit with uh, sticking that long arm in there to get him to lean, and then went with the chop. I think I was a little soft with my hand placement there. I, uh, I didn't do a good job selling that chop there. As you can see, my right hand's kind of trapped to the side. This play is kind of all about just me continuing to work around the edge and the other side did a good job of flushing them out, and boom, always make sure you're going for that ball because sacks are big, but if you can uh, turn the ball over, it's it's huge. Every day of practice, you always got to stretch that reach. Yeah, that was a great play, though, a great hustle play. Blow them up. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I did, I did double the team? <laughs> They're trying to double team you. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I think, yeah, this was early. This is like one of my earlier series where I just bull rush, so. Bad move to run the QB draw when you're at, on the nose guard, or on the center. Bad move. Little boys out there, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Man, I heard your, your weight room was broken into. As you guys deserve, we, we got you $5,000 um, for, for you and your team to, to go to that weight room and, and hopefully fix up your facility a little bit so you guys can take you to the next level you know great doing this with you thanks for getting on with me good luck in uh, all future endeavors i'm sure you have a bright one ahead of you just keep working hard